Hello, my name is Stan Campbell, and uh, the assignment for this Yellow Dig is to um, add on to possibly a lesser known um, scientist in nutrition. Um, I actually selected, it's one of the cards that I made, but I kind of found uh, uh, Justice von Liebig from the Holy Roman Empire. Uh, that's him. And uh, found him, and uh, he was back in 1803. But uh, the reason I chose him was basically uh, his work on uh, the chemical makeup of the carbohydrates, fats, and proteins, which basically are the key co cornerstones and most important things for our nutrition and how we get our uh, um, energy basically throughout the blood and throughout our body. Um, coming from a, a, a family, basically, of fertilizers, a uh, father who was in uh, um, salting of meats and hardware and dealing with manure. Um, he got the nickname of the father of the fertilizer industry because other works that he was doing also dealt with the nitrogens and all the breakdown of uh, food and soil and, uh, and making it enriched um, for growing of plants and such. Um, but going back to why I chose him basically is uh, his key discoveries about the carbos, um, proteins, and, and fats um, as a chemist. Um, so I categorized him in the nutrition chemistry area. Um, his, his family survived the global um, famine um, back in the late 1700s, uh, which kind of basically when we all deal with something massive like that in our lives, it tends to push us in one direction, and that's why I'm going back to school myself. Um, my medical issue pushed me into nutrition, and uh, at this late age, I hope to help as many people as I can. Um, the uh, websites I used um, was the school. Um, there was an encyclopedia site on my notes. I also had uh, a couple papers um, he was listed in. Um, I don't have those listed in front to put on the video, but it's in my assignment. Um, so this is probably a terrible yellow dig, but um, Justice von Liebig, that's who I chose. Um, created the laboratory um, method of teaching that was new um, and that continues in, in, in use. And also he was a Founder of uh, uni the organic chemistry, um, uh, German chemist and founder of organic chemistry. He was a professor at um, Gleason um, University. Um, so, only one person to be in the Swedish and Netherlands Academy of Arts and Science member, also. So, those are some of the other things. So apologize how herky jerky this might be, but I'll get better at it. Thank you.